Hi everyone, thank you so much for watching. I am going to be doing something so crazy in this video, but let me start off by saying, first of all, I am filming on my brand new Google Pixel 3 XL. I wanted to try it out. I didn't know what video to start with, but I went ahead and just put it on. So if you feel like the video is either better or worse, I am filming in 4K, which is amazing on this camera, on this phone. But I just got this phone. I was thinking about doing a review and yeah, there's so many cool features, which includes 4K video on a freaking cell phone. So I don't know about you, but if you've heard of this thing called magnetic eyeliner that you use to attach your magnetic eyelashes on. For a second, can you just think about that? So the other day I was scrolling through my Instagram and I happened to watch this ad where it showed this girl, but she placed eyeliner, first it was I think on the hand, and then took a magnetic eyelash that had a magnetic strip all throughout the entire lash instead of what you see now where it's like either two magnets on it or three magnets on it. She placed the eyelash on the line of magnetic eyeliner that she put on her hand and that thing stuck on so quickly and it didn't come off. And then you watch her putting the magnetic eyeliner all along her lash line and then taking her magnetic eyelash and sticking it on there and it clicked on and it stayed on and looked amazing. So I quickly tried to search for it and I found one company that does sell the magnetic eyeliner and then their own lashes and then the one particularly that I saw through an Instagram ad is a Kickstarter campaign for this company that is selling them. You can pre-order it. We haven't had a lot of great success with helping Kickstarter programs. Um, I can talk about that in a separate video but I just didn't want to spend my money on something that I could either never receive or receive it in like six months. So I thought, you know what? I'm gonna do something so crazy right now. <laughs> and I hope this isn't a flop because I've actually tested it out before before I recorded this video. So this is gonna be crazy. However, I thought, you know what? I just filmed a review on this BioVane Barcelona charcoal ma magnet mask. And the mask itself, the formula is magnetic. So you take the little tool and it pulls it right off. So I thought, you know what? I have a charcoal magnet mask. So here it is right here. Obviously it's not eyeliner. <laughs> First of all, let me just get that straight. It is a charcoal magnet mask. And I'm sure you've seen this all over. Obviously it's a lot lighter. It's not gonna be like a dark black. And you know, this is going to be a charcoal mask, but I thought, you know what? I'm gonna test this out. I'm gonna see if it works. I'm going to try it with both brands of magnetic lashes that I use. This one I use more. This is the Malole brand lashes. I did a giveaway with this company. Amazing company, amazing lashes. The easiest magnetic eyelashes I have ever used because they have three magnets on them. These are the one, two lash cosmetic lashes. These are kind of like the pioneer behind the magnetic eyelashes. So these ones only have two magnets. So those are the one, two lashes, and then you have the little bits to attach to the bottom. And then these are the Malole lashes, very similar, but these have the three magnets, one in the middle, and then you have your little attachments on the end. Okay, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna kind of do what I saw in the video on the um, Instagram ad. So I have this little eyeliner brush. It's super, super thin. You could also use something like this if you wanted to try this little uh, trick out for yourself but I wanted to use something super thin. So what I'm gonna do is I'm going to dig out a little bit of this magnetic mask right there, and then draw it on my hand, just like the Instagram ad. So I'm just gonna draw it all the way across, even though I don't have the magnets all the way across the strip of lashes. I just wanted to kind of do it like it would be for eyeliner. There is my quote unquote eyeliner line. <laughs> so I'm gonna go ahead and take the Malole lashes first, which have three magnets here. I'm gonna put it, you know what? I'm not gonna take the strip lash. I'm actually gonna do that on my eyes, but I'm gonna go ahead and take some of the bottom pieces here and show you if this really works. So here's my little eyeliner line. Here's the magnet lash, and then you just pop it right on and see how it kind of laid itself down and <laughs> it doesn't move. You guys, it sticks like 
magnet because there's magnet in the charcoal mask. Isn't that so crazy? So I'm gonna go ahead and take the other eyelash pieces that have the magnets on them and I'll show you again. And it totally just lays down by itself. So I'm gonna take another one here and show you again. Boom, oh, it jumped to the other side. Okay, there. And it just lays down. <laughs> oh my, look at how crazy that is. So it sticks, so here's the issue. Because it is a charcoal mask, it's not going to be eyeliner. So when you take it off, or if it falls off, it's going to take off the magnet mask as well because it's not, you know, it's a magnet mask. It's gonna come right off. So when you pull it off, it comes right off. Obviously, this isn't going to be like a dupe for the magnetic eyeliner because the magnet mask is not going to stay on your skin. However, I found it to be super helpful because if you have issues sticking on the magnetic eyelashes still after practicing, whatever the issue is, you can place this right along your lash line, have it be kind of like your guide for your magnet lashes, pop on your magnet lashes, and then put on the bottom ones. It's so easy. I've already done it once, so I'm gonna show you right now how I do it with both of these sets. So I know some of you might be concerned about putting a magnet mask right by your eyes, but I did this for a day just to test it out. It didn't irritate my eyes at all. There was absolutely zero redness, irritation, nothing. I think because this is a very all natural product, and so again, this isn't something that I would recommend doing on a daily basis, just because you know this isn't an eyeliner, this is a mask, and just for safety's sake, I just wanted to try this out to see if it would work. So when the magnetic eyeliner does come out, I know that I wanna buy it, and I know that I'm gonna be really excited about it because it really works. If this works, then it's gonna work with the actual magnetic eyeliner. So now I'm gonna go ahead and show you how I did it um, with the lashes on my eyes. Okay, so I have my eyeliner hack thingamabob. <laughs> so I have my magnetic mask as my eyeliner line. I don't know how weird that is, but I'm gonna go ahead and take this Malole magnetic eyelash with three magnets on it, and I'm gonna show you how it gets magnetized and how easy it was to put this on. Okay, so here we go, getting closer. You're gonna see it get attached. That was so easy. So then I would take my little magnetic pieces and not, you know, obviously you wanna use these still because it's not gonna stay on your lashes. I feel like this one was not happy. So I will take a little bit more of the magnet mask and look, it got stuck to it, ah! That's funny. And then I'm gonna take my little lash at the end and voila. It's not perfect, but you get it. The magnetic eyeliner, when it comes out, I feel like it's going to be a game changer for anyone who wears magnetic eyelashes and still has a little bit of trouble. So this is the first time you're doing this little trick with the one, two lashes. Let's see how well they get attracted to the mask. Okay, there's one side. And then the other side, ooh. They clicked on pretty quickly, but you see why I don't like these one, two lashes is because that middle part doesn't have a magnet and it kind of puckers up. It just doesn't look good to me unless I have a really thick line of eyeliner. And then I'm gonna take the little piece and stick it on the end and there. Okay, so now I have the other lash on and that was pretty easy. It's a really crazy trick, but it definitely works. I'm not, again, I wanted to say, I'm not saying that this magnet mask is a dupe for the magnetic eyeliner because it won't stay on your skin. However, if you wanted to try a little trick at home, you try this trick and you see if it works. But I am most excited about this new product coming out, which is the magnetic eyeliner, which literally you draw on just like I did, a strip of eyeliner, and then you take your magnetic lash and you stick it on your eye and it stays and you don't have to put any of the bottom pieces. So you can just go about your day, you wouldn't have to worry about the magnetic lashes falling off with the new magnetic eyeliner, which I plan to get. I am super, super excited. 
that is it for this video, this crazy, crazy video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Please let me know if you have any questions. Stay tuned and subscribe to my channel so you don't miss that video where I actually review the real magnetic eyeliner with their own version of magnetic lashes. And hit that notification bell so you know when I post videos. And I will see you guys all in my next one. Bye.